The parents of a woman murdered in Oceanside are fighting to keep their daughter's killer behind bars. Eric Nathaniel Marum is serving time for killing Nicole Sinkley in 2005. He was recently recommended for parole. ABC 10 News reporter Neil Watson spoke to Nicole's parents about their mission to get that decision reversed. There is a 120 day review period that follows every proposal of parole. He murdered her. He didn't just kill her, he murdered her with malice in his heart. Claudia and Glenn Sinkuli's daughter Nicole was asleep at an Oceanside apartment when her then boyfriend Eric Nathaniel Marum bludgeoned her to death with a hammer. I have children and a family that to me is perfect. And this guy comes along and he destroyed, he destroyed what we had. Marm was sentenced to 16 years to life in prison with a possibility of parole. He was first denied in 2019. He went back before the Board of Parole last month, where two commissioners granted a recommendation for release. We didn't even get a I'm sorry at this hearing. It, there's no remorse. It, it was all about his reform. Reform Commissioner David Long stated in the hearing transcript as the reason for the recommendation, saying Marum poses a low risk of future violence. But Claudia thinks otherwise, especially for her other daughter, Nicole's sister. She's out of state. She won't live near us because she fears for her life. The recommendation will go before the governor for review. The Sinculias have started a petition urging the governor to reverse the decision and uphold justice for their daughter. It's now going to be the community's problem that he's going to live in if he gets out. So it's a cry, you know, for the community to rally together because we need an army to do this. We really do. Neil Watson, ABC 10 News.